Welcome to live2clays.com, best e-learning portal for IIT JE, NEET and Foundation. Hello students, in this video I will discuss how to calculate molarity of a solution. There are two parts given here in this problem and uh, here you can see that solutions is given. Uh, in the first part 30 gram of uh, cobalt nitrate, it is having water, 6 moles of water it is having and it's uh, in 4.3 liter of solution volume of the solution is given and the mass of solute is given well this is the molarity formula molarity is equal to moles of solute upon the volume of solution in liters remember the units solute is used in moles and solution is used in liters to calculate molarity means the concentrate uh, concentration of a solution let me take the first part First we get the relevant unit, here we have the mass of solute and we convert mass of solute into moles. This is the 30 gram, 30 gram it is the mass of uh, cobalt nitrate and it is having 6 moles of uh, uh, water molecules. Then so you can calculate the molar mass, molar mass of uh, this substance by using a periodic table. A molar mass of uh, this compound is 291.035 gram per mole. So it means that here we have one mole, one mole has 291.035 gram and so it, it will give us the number of moles we can divide the value 30 is divided by 291.035 and so the value which we get that is 0 0.103 here we have 0 0.103 and uh, this is the moles moles of uh, solute formula is quite big that's why i mentioned here solute now next is uh, the volume of solution in liters it is already given in liter we can apply the formula and calculate the concentration of solution in molarity here we have molarity its symbol is capital m is equal to moles of solute is 0 0.103 and it is in moles and solution is 4.3 4.3 and it is uh, in liters liters now you can divide these values at the top we have 0 0.0.103 and it is divided by the volume of solution that is 4.3 and the value which we get that is 0 0.024 we can write this write this value in two significant figures 0 0.024 here we have 0 0.0 4 and it is moles per liter this is the concentration of solution similarly we can do the second part also b part here you can see that uh, 30 ml of 0 0.5 molarity solution is given as to so4 diluted to uh, 500 ml and we have to calculate molarity here you can see that the volume of h2so4 is given and uh, and so the concentration of H2SO4 is also given and this solution this solution is diluted to 500 ml here we can apply the formula M1V1 is equal to M2V2 and we can calculate M2 value that is the molarity this is V1 and this is M1 and this is V2 that is volume and so M2 value we have to calculate from this formula remember when we apply this formula we always use volume in liters because the molarity molarity is in moles per liter so that liter liter may cancel now we can do the con uh, conversion unit conversion then we can apply the formula here we have 30 ml 30 uh, we can say v once so let me write it it is a part here we have a part and it is b part v1 is equal to it is 30 ml and so we can convert 1 liters 1 liters is equal to 1000 ml and so we do the conversion 30 is divided by 1000 1000 and the value which we get 0 0.03 here we have 0 0.03 and it is in liters similarly v2 part also here we have v2 is equal to 500 it is ml and multiplied by 1 liter upon 1000 and it will give us 0.5 liters now we can apply the formula formula we have m1 v1 is equal to m2 and v2 m1 is that is the concentration of sulfuric acid h2so4 0.5 
here we have 0 0.5 multiplied by v1 value is 0 0.03 and it is in liters equal to m2 value we are going to calculate and so v2 value is 0 0.5 here we have 0 0.5 we can transfer this value 0 0.5 on left side then we get m2 is equal to here we have 0 0.5 multiplied by 0 0.01 sorry it is 3 and so upon here we have 0 0.5 0 0.5 0 0.5 will cancel out and the value which we get 0 0.03 and this is the molarity that is the concentration of the solution this is the molarity of the solution you can see that how i calculated both are having different uh, methods in this i applied in the first part i applied molarity formula to calculate the concentration of the solution and in the second part i applied the formula dilute solution formula that is m1 v1 is equal to m2 v2 here you can see that this much volume of h2so4 is diluted to 500 ml that's why we applied dilute solution formula m1 v1 is equal to m2 v2 to calculate m2 value that is also the concentration of dilute solution thank you if you like this video please click the like button if you have any questions or suggestions, please comment below. For more updates on IIT JE or need exams, please subscribe to our channel to get a lot of updates. Support us by following us on Facebook and Twitter. To sharpen your skills, please try out our test series on livetotalage.com. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.